How to use ChatGPT to write an essay. Hello guys, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the channel. And yes, if you are in need of writing an essay, ChatGPT can actually help you. Now, ChatGPT has a bunch of lovely features and the more you use it, the better you can become at actually harnessing what it's actually capable of doing. So we're going to jump straight in. Now, if you don't know, the website that you need to go to is chat.com openai.com and you'll get onto this page here basically you'll have the opportunity on the left hand side to create a new chat and this is what your page will look like now we must take into consideration that there are some limitations in terms of what chat gpt is able to give you and then it also shows you what its capabilities are and it shows you also a few examples of how you can actually communicate with chat gpt so what we're going to do here is i've actually opened up a document with a few commands and these commands are very basic so the way we're going to start out is we're going to say write me five title ideas for an article about photography of course you can change all the details about what the actual content is about we just paste it in there and we say enter and it's now given you five ideas about photography right so the next thing we're going to do now is of course you're going to have to look through there and choose which one suits you best and then you can actually change it accordingly if you would like to but what we're going to do is we're going to use it straight from there the next command you're going to put in there is write an essay outline for point four with headings now you're going to basically paste that and the reason we're saying point four is because we want to use this one over here of course if you want to use any one of those points you can use any one of those points so we're just going to say enter and it's basically going to give us an outline of the point four and it's going to give us headings with it so there you go it is starting to actually put that together and we give it a few seconds just to get that right so the next thing we're going to do is we are going to say i'm going to give you some information before you write an article do you understand now basically what we're going to do is prepare chat gpt to receive our instructions and we want to confirm that chat gpt actually understands our instructions so we have to ask it do you understand and we send that and remember now that chat gpt actually has the ability to remember your conversation so everything that has been said in this conversation in this chat it can actually remember so if you ask it to refer back to something in a previous text that we've made it can refer back so there is our full outline with headings and you can see that it's quite extensive and then we've asked it if it understands that we're going to give it some information and it says yes I understand please go ahead and provide the necessary information. Now this is the important part. What you're basically going to put here is an outline of wanting to write an essay with perplexity with a little bit of a humanized feel and touch to it so it says when writing an essay there are two crucial factors perplexity and boastiness perplexity measures the complexity of text and boastiness compares the variations of sentences humans typically write with greater boastiness for example longer and more complex sentences along with shorter ones ai sentences are typically more uniform therefore when writing the following essay I need you to use a good amount of perplexity and boastiness. And then you say, do you understand? So what it's basically going to do now is it's going to take all of those factors into consideration. And it's explaining to you what it's going to do. And it says that it now just needs your content or your topics. So what you're going to do now is we're going to copy this next prompt here and it says write a paragraph for each point including headings so it is sectioned like an essay so now we are referring back to the headings that were created earlier on right over here now this will take a while because it is quite a large 
article outline that it had given us. So we are just going to give it a few minutes and then we will be right back. And there we go. So it is now actually written quite an extensive detailed essay. And you can see here that there is quite a bit of information there. So it's also covered every one of the headings that we've asked it to cover. And you go. So what you're going to basically do now is what you can ask ChatGPT to do is change the word count. Now, you may actually want to keep it like this. But if you don't, if you don't want that many words in your document you can actually you can actually just paste it here and we can actually see how many words it is so if you see here on the bottom left hand side it is actually 657 so what we can actually say is can we say can you write the essay in more than a thousand words and let's copy that and we go back here and we're going to just paste this and we're going to say can you can you rewrite the essay in more than a thousand words and we are going to say go ahead and what it's going to do now is it's going to include a couple more words so that it can actually have more than a thousand words so here we go and let's give it a few seconds to generate and there you go so now that did take quite a while because it actually did quite an extensive improvement and I can guarantee you that is more than a thousand words. We don't have to check the word count, but just to make 100% sure, we're going to just take that and we're going to just replace it and see what the difference is. Now remember the first one was about 600 words and we can just paste this one in and we can see the difference here. see that now that is at a thousand two hundred words and that is fantastic so basically what you're going to do now is you're going to take your document and you are going to read through it you're going to check that everything is correct you're also going to change things that you need changed and you will edit accordingly and just make it a personalized piece of work so that you can actually connect with it and can actually be your own there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for watching the video. If you like the video, give us a like. And if you like the content that we put out, subscribe to the channel. And we'll see you in the next video. Cheers.